kind of grows those thoughts of actually I can work more or link more to my community where I live. And obviously in this area of the Head Start programme, that was something to prompt and instigate with the community activity that was set up here already. Because like when you feel like you're like, no one like really like hears, like you can't hear someone like calling for help. So you can now, now that we've now been down, we can like actually help people. I'm going to link a bit more to this about our youth action or what youth action is when we do a little bit of a thank you for your participation. As well. You're going to create a ladder of what you think, okay? Give up. Do competition, competition that everyone will take part in and have fun, mostly. Because on your post-it notes for letters, could you see that? Yep. All those letters on your post-it notes spell a word. Yeah, you have 15 minutes to work out what that word spelled. How to use it, use it. Can you tell me why you volunteered? Why did you do that? And would you do it again? Was it an internal reason? Or is it an external reason? I don't know, for the moment. And you can eat and we'll discuss it after some food. So as part of the, the you know, the, the training has been about what is, or what can a young person do? Often young people are told, you know, you're too young, it's not safe, you can't go out, etc. But young people have lots of voices, powers, etc. that they can make difference in community and also, you know, link with older generations. We've been linking to the fact of what's connection, what can young people do, what's motivation to do that and why would you do that? That's been our activities. If you want to break me, you can never break my love Cause that's what's inside of me, I choose to never give